What's going on, YouTube? Welcome back to another video, bro. Today I got a banger for y'all, bro. Yo, today's topic, bro. It took me a minute to like make this video, bro, because you know it's something that I really had to notice, bro. And before I, I even jump into the video, bro, you should already know what you should have been did, bro. You should have been click click that like button and hit that subscribe button, bro. Come on, bro. Help your boy out here. You feel me? But you know what I'm saying? Let's just jump into the video now, bro. Bro, when you're on semen retention, bro, is it just me, bro? Comment down below if this happens to you too, bro. Bro, why is it that it seems like all your all the people that you used to mess with in the past, why it seems like just old friends and stuff like that, it's like they it's like they trying to come back into your life low key, bro. You know what I'm saying? And I'm not even trying to throw no shade, bro. Like, this is just what I'm experiencing. This is what I'm noticing, bro. And it's, it's like, bro, it caught me off guard because I'm like, bro, I'm, I'm starting to feel like, bro, I feel like females could really sense when a man is on his purpose, bro. I feel like a female could really sense when a man is doing better for himself, bro. And, and friends as well. It don't just go for women, bro. You feel me? Like, friends, when you're on this journey, bro, friends are going to want to chill with you again friends are gonna want you to go back into this into the lifestyle that you was living before you feel me so if you was a smoker if you was a drinker if you was a partier um if you was the type that just loved to kick back and just cool it with your friends bro bro those friends those old friends they gonna try to come back just because they see you leveling up they gonna try to come back and try to put you back down to where they are you know what I'm saying? They're going to try to put you back down just because they see that you're headed somewhere that they're not. You feel me? So, bro, on semen retention, bro, you got to be aware of those type of people because there will be people who tries to come back into your life when they see you elevating, bro. And that's, excuse me, that's a part of the process, bro. You feel me? That's a part of the process. Don't, don't start, don't start exaggerating or start dissing people when they start to come back bro just 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 see it for what it is you feel me just see it for what it is you know what i'm saying back then they didn't want me now i'm hot they all on me you feel me that's the that's the quote i live by nowadays bro because man revenge is so sweet y'all see the shirt y'all see the shirt y'all see the hoodie man stop playing revenge is sweet bro you know what i'm saying i don't plan on i don't i'm not saying go get revenge on these people bro but revenge is so sweet, bro. That's why I was saying in my last video, bro, like, semen retention, it's gonna really make people notice you more, bro. You feel me? Like, bro, when, when I, when I, I'm barely on my Instagram like that. If you know me, I'm barely on there. So it's like, when people see me post, bro, it's like, it's like I caught them off guard. You feel me? It's like a celebrity just entered the room. You feel me? They like, damn, let me check out his story. Let me see what he got going on. You know what I'm saying? Just because I haven't seen him seen him in months. Let me see what he got going on, you know? And bro, this journey, bro, you really have to use discernment when you when you elevate and when you leveling up. You really have to use discernment in your life, bro. Because you don't know which people are for your greater for your greater good. You don't know who's low key preying on your downfall. You feel me? You don't know who's out to get you. You feel me? So you have to use your sense, your sixth sense of discernment, bro. Because I promise you, bro, people are going to try to come back once they see you doing better. And it's up to you on how you, um, it's up to you on how you play your cards when those people try to come back. Because depending on how you and, you know, let's say you and your old friend fell out, you know, it's up to you whether or not you decide to take them back into your life because i promise you bro your old friends or exes or people you used to mess with bro depending on the type of person they are that's why it's good to use discernment depending on the type of person they are bro they will try to knock you off low key they will try to lower your vibration bro you feel me they will try to turn you into the bring you back to the old person that you used to be you feel me Smoking all the time, drinking all the time, partying all the time, doing dumb stuff all the time. You know, and we don't got time for that, bro. We don't have time for that, bro. We're masculine men. 
on a mission. We're on our purpose. You feel me? We're masculine men out here holding on for dear life, bro. You really think we have time for people trying to come back into our life, bro? When you get around like certain people you used to be cool with, it's gonna trigger it's gonna trigger old memories, it's gonna trigger old pleasures, it's gonna trigger old things in your mind, and you're gonna become curious, like, hmm, let me try this again, let me do this again. You know what I'm saying? Like, bro. I'm trying to tell y'all, bro, this journey is supernatural. It's really supernatural. You really have to experience it for yourself to to get what I'm trying to say, bro. You know what I'm saying? Like some people, me just talking, telling my experience, for some people, that's not enough, bro. You feel me? For some people, it's just not enough. Me telling you what it is, it's just not enough for some people. You feel me? So you have to take that initiative to retain your own seed and see exactly and experience it for yourself you know what i'm saying but bro i've been noticing that people been trying to come back bro you know what i'm saying and i'm not bro i'm not trying to throw shade at anybody you feel me i'm not trying to throw shade i'm not trying to make it seem like i'm better than anybody bro you feel me like nah bro like but i just been noticing that people just been trying to come back bro and i don't know if it's because I'm elevating, I don't know if it's because they see my light, bro, I don't know, bro, you know what I'm saying, but obviously, I'm retaining my seed, so you know, it has to be something, bro, it has to be something spiritual going on as to why these people are coming back, you know, and bro, you have to learn how to protect your energy, bro, you have to learn how to know who's good for you and who's bad for you, bro, because, bro, I swear, bro, certain people are just out to drain your energy, bro. You have to really value your energy and really discern on who you let back into your life, bro. You know what I'm saying? Especially if things didn't end well in the past, bro. You have to really ask yourself, why am I talking to this person still? Why am I still dealing with this person? You know what I'm saying? But see, being on Seamer Retention, bro, is going to give you a new sense of direction, bro. You know what I'm saying? Old people you used to be cool with. They not going to really matter as much, bro, because you're so focused on the future. You're so focused on what's to come. You know, not saying that we're not, we not in the present, but, bro, retention really makes you, it really makes you focus on the bigger picture, bro. So, people, all these people trying to come back in your life, trying to lower your vibration, trying to bring you back to the old person you used to be, bro. You can't, you can't allow them to do that, bro. You have to value the man or female that you want to become you have to value your energy you have to value your time you know what i'm saying because bro i keep saying it bro these people are out to get us bro so not everybody but some people are out to get us bro you feel me because we have something that a lot of people don't have bro we're 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 one percenters bro we putting in the work on a daily basis bro we getting these gains on a daily basis bro feel me we looking good we smelling good, feel me? We walking with our chest up, head high, feel me? You think people not going to want to come back, bro? You think people are, are just going to sit you, you think people are just going to sit around and just let you elevate, bro, with no issues? Especially if y'all used to be cool or mess with each other in the, in the past, bro, they going to be wondering like, yo, you going to forget about me? You feel me? Like that's, bro, I'm, I promise you, bro, when you start to see people trying to come back, bro, just use your sixth sense of discernment, bro. Ask yourself, are these the right people I should be around? And more, and nine times out of ten, bro, if they're from the past, that's where they belong, bro. You feel me? They, if they end up, if they, if you left them in the past, that's where they belong. You feel me? So that's the video I wanted to say. Um, that's the video I wanted to get out to you guys today, man. I hope you guys enjoyed it. Wasn't a long video, you know what I'm saying? I said, let me take it light on them today. But if you guys can resonate with today's video, bro, let me know down below because I noticed that people been trying to come back or people are going to try to come back, bro. You feel me? So that's something to be aware of while retaining your energy, bro. So like, comment, and subscribe, bro. And you already know I'll catch you in the next one. <laughs>